The T-Rex Dino Fruit is officially here inside of Roblox Blocks Fruits. And, uh, hey, yo, Sugar Way, you wanna, you wanna slide me that fruit real quick, buddy? Oh my god, you want me to spend money on your stupid bots? Dude, I'm a brokey, help me out! Call me daddy, I'll say sure. Uh... Daddy? Oh, all right, here you go, man. You can take like a T-Rex fruit for free, man. Receive the gift of permanent T-Rex from Erectoway. Let's go! Ooh, and the present event will start in 10 minutes. Well, now that we have our hands on our little T-Rex fruit right here, let's go ahead and equip that. And let's go ahead and level up our prehistoric power to become overpowered and unstoppable while we wait for those gifts to spawn in. Hey, look, Erectoway, I have a furry tail now. Look at this. Ooh. You're not helping your case out here, man. You already yeah. look like a weird gecko. Hey, that's messed up, man. I thought we had something special here. Not anymore once you transform into a furry. All right, you know what, buddy? Tail swipe! All right, but with our first look at this fruit, we actually have some pretty nice M1 attacks. Like, look, we can do some pretty cool green slashes, just like how we just got our Kitsune fruit, and we can do slashes with that as well. I mean, if we actually take a look inside of the fruit shop right here, the T-Rex fruit is another beast-type fruit. And you know, in all of these recent Blocks Fruits updates, we have been getting a bunch of new beast fruits, like the Mammoth fruit, the Kitsune fruit, and even the Dragon fruit, which is actually in progress of getting a brand new rework. So guys, I'm gonna need you to go ahead and hit that subscribe button right now so you can stick around for when that dragon rework comes out and I make a video on it. And I'm gonna also need you guys to go ahead and hit that like button so I can see who is truly as hype about this T-Rex fruit as I am, you know? So if you're glad that this fruit is now in the game, go ahead, leave a like. But you know, enough yapping, okay? We need to go ahead and get some mastery and oh my god, we actually do a good amount of damage with our slices! Oh, those slices sound beautiful too. They sound a lot Large and beastie, just like a T-Rex. It's just like we're swinging our T-Rex claws. Oh, we hit 76 mastery, and we unlocked our first move called the Predatory Screech for 50 mastery. Oh, and I mean, we also have our Tail Swipe for one mastery, and I, I forgot about that, even though I just smacked directly across the face with it. But you know, let's go ahead and take a look at what these abilities do. Starting off with our Tail Swipe, we've got the nice little stance. Our tail is just moving around in the back there. Send the Slice, and oh, we can actually hit it far range our tail swipe actually does a good amount of damage almost 3k damage okay but what about our other move we just unlocked our predatory screech well i mean we got all of these dudes coming after us and i mean if we're about to screech at these dudes with this ability i'm assuming it's gonna do some good aoe damage so let's get them all nice and together and then let's go ahead and load it up oh it's just doing it right off the bat yo 15k damage what hold up were we inhaling air and doing damage did we just let it all out let's do that again oh we're inhaling and then oh we just blast it right back at them and it actually does 15k damage Hold on, one more time one more time let's do it again inhale exhale that's op and then hit him with the tail swipe right after we got him all nice and low go ahead give me some more mastery yet again another new skill available oh my god guys this new t-rex fruit this new dino fruit this is looking nice already but hold up hunter's rage that's our next ability what does this do i'm loading it up we have like a little slice aura around us we've got green glowing claws as well hey yo and we've got the little hunter stance like we're about to pounce on our enemy harder than i pounce on your guys' moms? Honestly, let's just go ahead and send it at him. This looks overpowered as well, just with the load up. Hunter's Rage! 3.5k damage. And then let me get a zoomed out view with the Hunter's Rage. Oh, it has like a silhouette of the dino head as well. One more time, Hunter's Rage. Oh my god. And then again. Oh my god, the claw marks on the ground. But again. And again. Yo, that dino head silhouette Loki goes hard. It's kind of like the mammoth fruit attacks when they're all silhouetted before you transform. And again, one more time to finish these dudes off. Hunter's Rage. Alright, and a good amount of mastery, but we need about 100 more for our F move, and then another 100 after that for our reptilian skills, which I'm assuming is our transformation. So now I need to go ahead and, you know, start buying some respawn bosses game passes, because we're gonna have to do a lot of grinding on Big Mom up there. You know, she loves when we grind on her. Okay, and, uh, Rectolite over here got her super low, and, um, 
I did I didn't get in the okay I'll, I'll be back boom, boom there we go with 300 mastery exact which means we unlocked our gigantic leap move and our reptilian scales move and you know I'll go ahead and show you guys the gigantic leap you know it's pretty simple you know you just load it up you've got a nice little green aura around you just like our little hunter's rage move and oh my god the effects go super nice on this one too but then we can go ahead and send it out of our opponent and leap on them for 3k damage let me go ahead do it again and die again Gigantic leap. Oh, we got a crit hit with that one. And then we can also send it from the air. Gigantic leap. You know, pretty simple. We can just lunge at our opponent, just like our hunter's rage ability. But now it is time to take a look at our reptilian skills move, our final ability for 300 mastery. So now it is time to transform into the T-Rex. Oh my God, we sent down fireballs when I did that too. And we had the nice little fire effects when we transformed. But look at this. We are now a menacing T-Rex inside of blocks roots oh and we've got jump effects when we're jumping in the air too we can still do our m1s as well oh our final m1 actually is a roar and another one of our m1s is actually a chop we can take a bite out of our opponent just like that that is so cool and on top of that i think it does burn damage the ticker's still going up oh my god i think i read on the wiki that the transformation actually has an ability that'll keep doing damage the farther you get from your opponent it. Like, look at that. It's going up crazy now. Guys, this T-Rex fruit just keeps getting better and better. Oh, even our dashes look super cool, too. We're literally running T-Rex style. We can charge on our opponent furry form at all. Now, let's go ahead and take a look at what our abilities do inside of our transformation. But, uh, first, the presence event is about to start in five minutes. So, I want to go ahead and do that real quick. So, uh, let's go ahead and de-transform and see what that looks like in the time being. Okay, okay, pretty simple. Just a big gust of green aura. Okay, and now this dude's attacking me. Oh, oh, he just disappeared. Okay, what the? But I'm gonna go ahead and make my way all the way over to the Candy Cane Island. I think we also might get a slight speed boost with this fruit, just like how we do in Kitsune as well. All right, the presence of it is starting. It's spawning in. Here's the big gift. Open it up. Give me my fruit. Give me my fruit. What am I gonna get? Ooh, present right here. Let me go ahead and open that up. What am I gonna get? I unwrap barrier. Okay. Yeah, okay. That, and that dude got spin. Yo, we got amazing fruits, bro. <laughs> but let me go ahead and store that. And then, you know, I also haven't spun for a fruit yet today. So come on. Maybe I can get something better here as well. Give me something good. Give me something good. Nope. Oh, okay. I got a spin too. Bruh. But now time to take a look at these abilities and our transformation. Let's go ahead and transform once more. And oh my god, those fire effects go crazy and they actually did damage oh and i was right when we attack our opponent it adds a little effect on them above their head right there and it does damage to them when we're not near them aha buddy i can just shred you and i'm not even near you you're gonna die look at that he's dead easy but let's go ahead and take a look at what our tail swipe does load it up oh we're in the dino post for the tail swipe send it at him oh it's nice and big oh my god that's actually doing so much damage oh my god t-rex transformations op let's do it again tail swipe it does a bunch of attacks and one more time, tail swipe. Sends a bunch of slices at them. That's OP. That is OP. And then how about our predatory speech? Is it even more stronger in our transformation? Oh my god, we're sucking even harder. And we blew hard. Oh, it's shredding him too. 6k damage. 7k damage. Hold up, how much damage can I do if I get all of these dudes together? Let me go ahead and rally them up. Come on, guys. Follow the big dino. Got them all together. Hit them with it. And boom. 25k damage predatory screech not too bad in the dino transformation all right we're at 30k damage now and then how about our hunter's rage let's go ahead load it up oh we're in attack stand send it at them oh we grabbed them and threw them around in our mouth hold on i gotta do that again load up the hunter's rage and we're in our stance and oh my god we literally grabbed them and flailed them around and the stance for this move is just everything oh this is menacing this fruit just keeps getting better and better Let's do it one more time. Flip them around. We have the chop effects too. And then let me go ahead and get super high up so we can take a look at our final move, which is our gigantic leap. Go ahead, load it up. Send it down. Oh my god, it's in fire. Oh, I just love this. And I love how this fruit has a roar effect just like how leopard does too. Oh, it's beautiful. And let's go ahead and leap on him again. Boom, the fire and everything. And you know, 
I kind of like the fact that when we transform, it has fire effects. And when we also do our gigantic leap, it has fire effects as well. And not only sets them on fire, but adds the little predator prey effect to them as well. But let's go ahead and finish this dude off. Get out of here, buddy. You're dead. And boom, guys, that is the brand new T-Rex fruit inside of Roblox Blocks Roots. Smash that like button and hit subscribe for more videos like these. And also comment down below if you want me to kill every single boss with this fruit as well.